Like damn, she in her mood. 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 She lit. Your money too. Like damn, she in her mood. Hello, ladies. A one's day ones. And if you're a new one, please subscribe to the channel. Happy 2024. All right, look, I hope you're following me on TikTok. They show me a lot of love on TikTok. So I've been a little bit more active over there. Your girl went live. We did a whole session. Shout out to the girlies who came through. I really love it over there. Um, and we did lipstick. We did lipstick nails inspired by the Nail Did Nail cards. Really cute. Um, we had a lot of fun. I laid down everything, showed you how to do these lipstick nails. Now, I broke my cardinal rule, which is I always change my monomer when I'm working with dark colors and light colors. I've mentioned that several times in other videos. These are too contrasting. You're gonna have bleeding. There is a cute little technique to avoid that. I mean, what kind of nail tech would I be if I did that and left that bleeding like this um, and just ignored it? And then my client was like, mm, like, go out in the sun and get some good light. And you're like, I, why is this a different pink than the rest? Like, why, why is it bleeding? It looks so different. I don't like it. You know, what kind of nail tech would I be like? Oh, girl, it's just a little bit of bleeding. Like, it ain't nothing. Just deal with it. No. And I didn't even like it. I looked at it for one whole day. One whole day, I teetered, and I was like, dude, uh, you know, can I just deal with it? I'll cover it up. I'll do a design over it. I didn't like it. I felt like um, it was because I was on live, and I didn't want to, like, get up, and I forgot to put a little side monomer, um, and we were just having fun and talking, and I was just laying the set, but I was not happy with that on both ends. As a tech and as a client, I absolutely did not love it. So anyway, girl, after I laid the whole set and I was getting ready for my bling, I just couldn't, I couldn't deal with it. Okay, the OCD was like, no, she was OCD and she was like, no. I shaved it down, clipped off the tip. I'm going to start fresh on this finger, which is good for you um, because I did uh, do this set on TikTok Live. But I figured since I was revamping one finger, I'll do it here with you guys. That way you can kind of see how this set was laid and how it unfolded. Um, I'm going in with squares. I'm not a square person, but I love using squares for lipsticks. Um, and I love a lipstick shape. I will pick coffin and lipstick number one. So you watch me get her together. We prepped her for application. I put down my clear base layer, my protective layer. And now I'm going in with that beautiful cotton candy pink. Um, I'm not mixing you know the dark red with the light pink i'm not dirtying up my monomer it's fresh clean monomer and i have a beautiful light pink nail and i love it i just think she's going with this set like i there's nothing wrong with the pink and red ombre i thought she was quite beautiful i could have finessed it much better i know better so um maybe before Valentine's Day, we still have plenty of time. I will do, just to prove it, just to prove that I can do it, uh, the pink and red ombre set. But I just, what I don't know what, I was distracted on live. I don't know what made me do just, just, just one finger ombre and it was bleeding. I didn't like it. I didn't like it. So anyway, being that I'm the client and the tech, I was able to switch it out. So now I'm getting inspired again. Now I'm like, okay, this is the set that I want to do. So beautiful. I love a lipstick shape. I can't say that enough. Um, so basically, this is what I did. This is how I laid this acrylic. This is how I finessed the shape. And um, yeah, so we're going to move forward. This is a pretty short video because most of it was done on TikTok Live. Again, I hope you're following me over there. Um, I don't like announce it often, but I will spontaneously be live over there. Um, and then you can see that we are doing the nails together. I'll answer any questions that you may have. And uh, usually it's just a good old time being silly and stuff like that. All right, she's laid. I am going to clear cap her. I clear cap for body. I clear cap to make sure my apex is apexing the way that I like it to make sure I get my nails built up the thickness that I like. Um, and uh, I just love the way clear acrylic looks and files over color acrylic. I just really enjoy it. So I do cap my color, especially to like stretch my color even further. Sometimes a brand will come out with a color acrylic and then next year it's not there you know and it was one of your favorites so it is an option to like kind of stretch it out a bit all 
All right, girl, we're all finished here. We have laid and slayed our acrylic. I'm just going to let her dry. And then I'm going to shape her real quick, get her all the way together, get her looking like the rest of the girls. Um, and then we're going to decorate because I did go back on TikTok live to decorate them with the girls. So that will be live footage. All right, you guys, I am laying this bling on TikTok Live, and I'm super excited. This is the inspo, very cutesy, very Valentine's y. There's a bit of a method to the madness. I want to add the rhinestones with the red rhinestones and just make it very, like, kind of organizy, clean looking. Um, that's just me. So I'm going in carefully and just building them section by section. That way, I can get a very even, cohesive look for this design. Something that I forgot to mention was these are C-curve squares. So they have a heavy C-curve to them and I shape them into lipsticks, which I've never done a lipstick C-curve. Really cute, really sexy. Um, but when I'm adding my stones, I want to be sure not to really put them on the side of the nail. The C-curve kind of really wraps around that finger. Um, so I don't want it to look bulky and wide. So I am just running the gems just down the front, the front edge of that side, if that makes sense. Just really particular to keep them clean and narrow and, and not letting them be bulky. And I started playing around with a couple shapes that I saw in the gem boxes. I mean, it is Valentine's Day. I saw red hearts, AB hearts, and I also had red bows. So I definitely wanted to incorporate those pieces in my uh, bling outline. Side by side, you could be my baby. Let me make you my baby. Girl, you're 
with me and got a dude looking crazy. See, all I want you to do is be my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. Y'all, y'all know how much I love and appreciate y'all for watching. These nails are so cute. Like, I love when I get a set that I that I just fucking love. And I love these. I love the lipstick. I love the bling. I found these big-ass cherries. I was like, you know what? It's Valentine's Day. She's giving a look. She's big. She's chunky. She's cute. She's a cherry. I am going to apply it with acrylic because, um, yeah, she's big. She's chunky. She's going to snag on things and tug and pull so i am going to apply this charm with acrylic but girl girl i am loving these so cute especially you know i am a left-handed person so i can't really there wasn't much option for me to do like any hand painting designs or things like that because i just i can't really do it with my right hand um so i went for a bling look i think she's very cute and how much would you pay for a set like this? Like, we have medium, they're at least medium long, lipstick, uh, two color acrylics, plus full bling outlines. So cute. You guys, I love you. I appreciate you. Subscribe to the channel. Cop the nail cards. Like, what? They're so fun. Have fun with yourself or a client. It just keeps you busy and working with things that you don't often do. Like, when was the last time I did lipstick nails? Come on. So I really do enjoy that about these cards, just stepping out of the box and continuing to incorporate all the things that we love about nail art and design. You guys, you know, I'm going to post my little photo shoot. I'm going to post my little photo shoot. She's so beautiful. I love you. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. And don't forget to stop by my lives because that's why we had like a half kind of video today. But if you stop by the lives, then you get like a live video. So I'll see you there. Bye. Like damn, she in her mood. Like damn, she in her mood. Like damn, she in her mood. Like, damn, she in her mood. Like damn, she in her mood. She lit, your money too. Like damn, she in her mood. In the mirror, I'm doing my dance. Hey, you packing out nobody's pants? He a rapper, but don't got a chance. Sucking my waist, so I'm moving my beans. Like a million views in a day. There's so many ways to get paid. I tried dipping, he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna rum. Big boots in the bus, they pump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like, I tell you, always stay hot. Oh, they mad cause I keep making bops. Oh, she mad cause I'm taking her spot. If I was bitches, I'd hate me a lot. Like, damn, she in her mood. Like, damn, she in her mood. Like, damn, she in her mood.